guys how are you this is Pau I know that it has been a very long time since I did my last video and I want to apologize guys thank you so much for still being here you know uh, I've been busy like I feel like a life gets too busy and with the moving with the reality show I did uh, with the wrestling and having a baby like when it's not a baby but it'll forever my baby but you know but it's not excuse to not catching up with you and I just want to do like a short video because actually today and this is what I'm saying I've been traveling a lot and I want to be able to cover a little bit of everything but this is gonna be like a short video so just to give you guys a little update of what has been happening what I'm gonna be doing what I did and eventually I'm gonna be separating each one of them of the subject so I can talk about it uh, a little bit more a little bit deep into it because uh, so many changes so many things and I am super excited to share with you and I know so many of you uh, would love to know and to have a little update about uh, not just me but also my family well if you guys notice first of all I have changed the name of the channel because I feel like uh, I want to be able to share a little bit about our family and I know you guys are here because you know us from 90 Day Fiance and uh, not just Paola solo uh, and so I changed the name uh, probably I'm going to change it again <laughs> I don't know but I'm just trying to make this channel a little bit like family of course I'm going to be posting things like uh, by myself uh, things that I do separate with my family but also you guys are going to see more, more about Ross and Axel on this channel so I hope you guys enjoy if you guys have any suggestion about what would you like to maybe Ross do or Axel do or we do as family uh, please just comment below uh, but first of all uh, as you guys know we moved to Oklahoma City we are back to Oklahoma City uh, I know it has been like a couple of months since we did it uh, there are many reasons why we did it and I'm just thinking about it like uh, after everything was happening in Florida uh, I don't know this is the only time that I'm feeling like I'm so glad to be in Oklahoma and I'm praying for the people in Florida and I hope uh, they can just recover from everything that they went through uh, through this all this stuff the hurricanes and all that stuff uh, but yes guys we're in Flor in Oklahoma uh, we're gonna be here for a little bit uh, we one of the first houses that we got uh, is in Oklahoma City and we rented and the people that were living in here they actually did some damage to the house like the house needs some fixing so we decided to move back to do all those fixing I'm gonna show you guys because um, one of my siblings who is here in Colombia I have two siblings in here in Colombia which I'm going to be talking about it too because uh, uh, it's, a, it's another thing that I want to share with you but I, I know right now so one of my siblings uh, is going to help me to like uh, to change a lot of things in the house so we can rent it or sell it if possible um, so we can move back I don't know Okeechobee or something because uh, you guys know how I feel about Oklahoma and look my sibling my brother is here and t I'm telling you he he understands me but uh, but not complaining right now just yet so but yes we're here that's what we're gonna do that's first of all and I'm, we're gonna show you guys what we're gonna do with the before and after and all that stuff so that's why I want to show you guys this channel more of like a family channel uh, okay so other thing guys as you guys know uh, I was competing on the show called the goat on Amazon Prime it's already there you guys haven't seen it I'm sorry this is going to be a spoiler uh, but it will be fun even if I tell you that I'm the winner uh, that will be funny you guys watch it because it's a really nice story and I really want to make another video talking about me living in there all what I went through and all the things that I did to be able to win um, because it was a very amazing experience for me to be able, I feel like I was representing 90 Day Fiance uh, in some way, but but it, this was a completely different show. It was not about my relationship, it was a competition show. And uh, and, and being able to win, uh, I feel like it was not just about the money, it's just the fact that when you are able to accomplish things like that is such a uh, such an amazing joy. Like, I don't know, being able to say, yeah, I'm the go. That's why I changed my name. Like I, right now in the wrestling world, I'm Paola the Colombian Goat, but more on that later. Uh, but yeah, just winning that show, it was, it was amazing to be honest. I am so grateful, so happy uh, with the people that I got to meet in the house. Christine, mwah, you have my heart, you are amazing. All the people I got to meet uh, and that I, I'm still in touch, tag to 
awesome. Uh, I feel like it, and that's why I want to talk to you about each one of them, how they actually like, they were a big part of how I was able to win. And the little drama that you guys saw on the clips, and there is a little bit more details into that because I know. <laughs> so as you guys know, whatever I am, I'm always going to send up for myself. You know, my personality is never changing. Even though I think I'm a little more like calm right now, like I'm not that fighter anymore. If you guys, if you guys were to have an update, uh, Ross and I, and believe me, you will guys will see the change. I think uh, it's just growing up and taking responsibility and all this stuff and like, I feel like I am more, I'm very different right now. And still, I stand up on my ground with the things that I believe and all that stuff, but I'm, I'm a little bit more like, like I understand a little bit more and control more my emotions sometimes. I'm not going to say all the time. Uh, but yes, um, that's about the goat. Another video on that uh, because that's something super cool. Other thing that uh, I just recently did, guys, I just signed my first wrestling contract and I am super, super thrilled about it. And of course, another video about that because I want to tell you guys how um, how I was able to get into, uh, into WOW, Women's of Wrestling. Uh, it's You guys are going to be able to see me on Paramount uh, on the next season, season three. Uh, but yes, I am, I don't know, I feel like uh, this time in wrestling, it, it's going so well. Like, I was able to work uh, this year with WOW, sign with WOW this year, and I'm representing, I don't know, I just feel like I'm so grateful to be able to work for that brand and what they stand up for. It's all about women and the talent, the people in there that I met and the people that have been helping me to develop my character and my wrestling skill and all that stuff. I met them in WOW and I'm super, super grateful. And Dave McLean, like, of course, uh, giving me the opportunity to be part of this amazing company. But I'm gonna make you guys, I show you a video, even with the amazing gear I'm wearing, because uh, they had amazing talent in there that they were able to make my beautiful blue gear in such a short time. That's why I wanna make a video about it because I wanna give them credit, the credit they deserve. And that, yes, wrestling is doing amazing. Uh, I have a match in Orlando on the 7th. Uh, so I'm going to tell you guys, uh, of course, on Instagram, maybe in here um, uh, before uh, that match. It's in Orlando, so you guys are in the area. That would be awesome if you guys can make it. Uh, what else, guys? Um, okay, so there is another thing uh, that when I when you guys watch the code, um, I was mentioned that if I win the, the big prize, and I have said this many times, it's not, I'm telling you, this is not about the money, this is not about, like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. It's just like the things that I said on the show, like that I was going to adopt uh, if I win, like that money will help me to adopt. That's always been there. Even before I did that show, uh, it's not an easy process. It's something that Sky, no, go. Sorry, my dog. Go, girl. I'll go. Okay. My dog. Oh my gosh. Right now I have a dog, two sugar gliders, and four chicks. And that's not all. <laughs> it's coming more. It's coming more. But anyways, so what I was saying, guys, uh, the money was going to help me to uh, to start the process of adoption because you need to have a stability. And even though, like, I was looking for that stability before the show to be able to adopt. And uh, and I know some people has been asking me about it on my social media, on Instagram, about how it's going and all that stuff. And also, if I'm planning on having more kids, <laughs> I'm telling you guys, I would love to have another kid, but I'm working and I really depend on my body right now for that. And also, I just want, I want to adopt before having another kid. I'm not saying that I won't, I will, I will. If, of course, the universe allows me to have another kid, of course, I will have it uh, when I take a little break on my, my third wheel. <laughs> uh, I just remember that people make fun of me when I say that. Um, so I think like uh, if the universe gave me the possibility of being pregnant again, of course, it will be a blessing. But for now, of course, I'm focusing on, on what I'm doing because I'm doing great right now. And I feel like you need to have a stability in order to bring somebody else to your house. And you don't want to be leaving complaining that you don't have enough and all that stuff. I feel like I, I want to be more organized. People do what they have to do. I just want to feel like I have enough uh, to live a comfortable life and to provide for my family. Like I'm coming from a very, um, uh, like a difficult family growing up. So I just feel like it, for me, it's a lot of pressure not being able to have that stability. And it, it, it worries me not to have it because uh, because of my past. And so I prefer just to, like, to play safe. 
but my husband and I, like I'm going today to Colombia and my husband is going to meet me next week. Uh, we're going to be looking into, um, into in Colombia, we're going to be looking there um, uh, into adoption agencies and see what the options are and because we haven't decided uh, where it's going to happen. I feel like it. I feel like it, whatever is going to mean, like whatever is going to meant to happen is going to happen, right? Like if it's go, we're going to adopt a, 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 a girl in Colombia, we're going to adopt a girl in Colombia. If it's going to happen in the United States, it's going to happen in the United States. You know, it's just, uh, I don't know. It's just, I feel like it, that's what the universe wants and that's what, what's going to happen. But what we're trying to do is just to do it right. And it's a long process. And, and of course, um, uh, I want you guys, if you guys want to, of course, uh, I'm going to be sharing a little bit of that. I'm going to be sharing about my trip to Colombia because uh, this is going to be a family trip. My fam, my son, I haven't met some of uh, uh, his cousins. So we're going to go to Cartagena. We're going to uh, be like a, my, my, almost my whole family, the family that I grew up with are going to be there with me. So I'm just want my son to to enjoy the time with them, with my father, my mother. I haven't seen them in like a year, I think, and uh, and I just want him to have fun in there and just practice his Spanish and just not forget that he is also Colombian. Uh, and for me to be able to do this and like I just wanna, I love to share my happiness with the rest, and I feel like I've been able to bring them all together and like a short trip that is going to be beautiful. So, and I'm going to share that with you all. Uh, I promise you guys, I'm going to be start posting more often. I do, I do. I have some videos in there that I still have to post. Um, but I feel like I'm taking a little bit more break on the wrestling. Uh, I'm not as busy as I was at the beginning of the year. So that's why uh, I am going to be able to share more with you guys. And, um, and if you guys are new to my channel, just click the subscribe button uh, because more updates are, are coming this way. I want to share with you guys this journey about adopting and, and, and see how this goes because I really, it's, it's something new and, and I'm so happy to do it. And so I want you guys to be part of that. Uh, and I, that's pretty much it. I, I said that I want to make this video super short and uh, I'm trying, I'm trying. But yes, guys, I know there is so much more to share with you all. Uh, also, also, before I forget, uh, um, my fitness app is, uh, like, you can download my fitness app right now. Uh, it's available on Android and also on on iPhone. So it's super powerful fit. Yeah, two hours. Uh, so you can download my app. Uh, it's going to, I am going to uh, add so much more than what it is right now. And it's challenge are coming. Uh, it's going to be amazing because you know what? You and I need to start like getting ready for December because we're gonna be eating a lot, so we better work out, <laughs> right? So yes, guys. So don't forget to download my app. You're gonna find like free exercises too, uh, but also on the app you're gonna start. Uh, you're gonna find like vlogs, recipes, workouts, uh, challenge, um, and so much more. So that's something else that I don't know if I forgot to mention, but I am super excited to be able to do something that I have so much passion. Uh, as you guys know, I'm a personal trainer and also a nutrition coach. And so um, I wanna be able to go back to provide that for you all because uh, yeah, I feel like I've been a little away, but I also not completely because I've been working towards developing a, a really awesome app for those, my fitness enthusiasm. Enthusiasm means a lot of things. <laughs> but yes, guys, so super excited for all the things that are coming and I want you to be part of it. So, yeah, so don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching this video. Give it a like. And any suggestion, what else would you guys would like to see now that I'm going to be in Colombia? Um, yes, maybe I can show you guys some Colombian food, typical things and things like that. Because I, You know what? My brain is going all over the place. So, well, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Many, many kisses. Until the next time.